Good morning, everyone. Today I am on the uh, 17th hole of the Brigantine Golf Course in front of our one of my favorite spots, this pond here. It's always filled with awesome wildlife, uh, ducks and uh, geese and some actual uh, uh, bay birds that come over here to get away from the wind sometimes. <coughs> And naturally, we're always seeing rabbits and, uh, and all sorts of things like that. Today, I want to talk to you about this object right here. This is the brain. And this is it. This is what controls every function in your body. This brain is the communication network for everything. All the messages for every function, every process, the way every system in your body works, has to come from the brain. The brain sends its messages through this area down here. This is called the brain stem. The brain stem is the regulatory area of the communication network. And then from the brain stem, we have the upper, upper end of the spinal cord. And that's how the messages get to the body. The brain sends its messages through the brain stem, down the spinal cord, out the spinal nerves, to every organ every tissue, every cell, every system in the body, and that's how your body functions. That's how your body knows what it needs to do. It all comes from the brain, the master communication network of the entire body. How does this relate to chiropractic? It relates to chiropractic in every way imaginable. Your spine is what protects this communication network from harm and injury. It starts with the spinal bones, which cover and protect your spinal cord, but the skull up here protects your brain from harm and injury. And then your skull sits on top of that first cervical vertebra, your atlas, which then is right underneath the brain stem. So any misalignments in that atlas vertebra is going to put pressure on this brain stem. And then the communication network is, is not going to be as good as it should be. And when the spinal bones are out of alignment, it starts to press on the nerves that go to the different organ systems in the body. And then that's how we have issues, all right? When there's no communication or when there's less communication from the brain to the rest of the body, then we have malfunction. And when we have enough malfunction, that's when we have illness or disease. So chiropractic's main purpose, yes, I know you come to the chiropractor for your aches and pains. That's what we're there for too. We balance the musculature. But every time you get adjusted, chiropractic's main purpose is taking nerve pressure off of the nerves that come out of the spine from misaligned vertebra. This improves the communication from the brain to the rest of the body. And this helps your body work better. That's why chiropractic is health care. It's just not sick care or symptom care, it's health care. And it all has to do with this brain's communication. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this scenic view as well as my message. You take care and have a great day.